Hey, business calculus students. What we're doing today is finding present and future values. Now, we did this earlier in the semester. What's different here is we've got an income stream. So we think of uh, $10,000 being paid per year. And we don't think of that as being paid at the beginning of the year or the end of the year, but throughout the year. So every day you're getting money, and all that money adds up to $10,000 per year. And we're going to do this for 40 years. Now, let's talk about how we're going to compute this. Your formula for present value is the integral from 0 to m, m is how long you're going for, of your income stream, s of t, e to the negative rt dt. So let's do the conversion here. It's going to be from 0 to 40. We're going 40 years. Our income stream is $10,000. E, our rate is 3%, so that's negative 0.03t dt. All right, if we plug that in using technology, what we get is 232,935 dollars. And let's see, how many cents? 26 cents. Now let's just Think about that for plausibility. If you got paid $10,000 per year for 40 years, well, that amount just in and of itself is $400,000. This is how much you'd have to deposit at the beginning of the 40 years to make sure that you could pay out $10,000 per year for 40 years. And it's a number less than $400,000 because, of course, interest is going to help. Let's do the same thing for future value. So our formula for future value is 0 to m, s of t, that's our income stream, e to the r, m minus t, dt. So that's going to be the integral from 0 to 40. Our income stream is 10,000, e to the point zero three times 40 minus t dt. And when we get this, that's a total of 773,372. And how many pennies? 31 pennies. Now note, that is more than 400,000. Why is that more than 400,000? Because you've allowed your money to increase due to the interest. So for example, the very first payments have had almost 40 years of interest. So you would expect this number to be less than the 400,000 and this number to be greater than the 400,000. And that's how you find the present value and future value of an income stream.